welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle today I'm going to be doing the latest travel news worldwide part one so uh, let's jump right into it now before that if you please subscribe to my channel and if you haven't already done so and it is the red and white subscribe button also click the notification bell um, because it'll show you every video on my lifestyle channel and my travel channel that I upload um, on both my lifestyle channel and my travel a channel I'm uploading videos at four times a week now so let's get right into it now according to breakingtravelnews.com is where I've got the information the following fantastic points are the latest travel news so let's jump right into it now um, number one is the UNWTO revealed a huge cost of COVID-19 on global tourism the UNWTO world tourism barometer shows that near complete lockdown imposed a response to the pandemic led to 98 percent fall in international tourists um, in may compared to in may 2019 um, hopefully tourism will get back up um, to countries around the world and um, in time um, when it's obviously safe to do so and number two Rwanda has reopened tourism as flights return yay another country that's reopened and Rwanda if you don't know where the country is is in Africa um, it's East Africa very small country um, and it's reopened to tourism so yay all passengers are to show proof of negative COVID-19 test from the certified laboratory and take within 72 hours of arriving in Rwanda so anybody that does want to go to Rwanda for tourism around the world um, they will need to take a laboratory test um, with a negative COVID-19 within 72 hours of arriving but it's great news that the country is off and running to tourism again and I wish the country like any other country the best of luck and hopefully it goes as safely as possible now number three Wizz Air is to relaunch Russian routes next month so yay that's brilliant news again for Russia and Wizz Air so people that want to travel with Wizz Air have more to choose from in regards to routes now according to local newspapers um, point number four um, like the Daily Star Spain, France, Italy, Germany um, could be taken out of the safe zone from quarantine has uh, more cases unfortunately have arrived 
there um so you may have to take um if you visit to any of these countries self quarantine afterwards for 14 days so if you went for a week or two weeks then you would have to quarantine for 14 days after you visited so if you do work then it's like taking at least three weeks off or at least um, 10 days some reports say some are 14 um, but you will have to take near enough two weeks off after you visited the country um, number five the Algarve Portugal is to welcome its first Formula One Grand Prix wow that's absolutely exciting news uh, for Formula One fans and um, the Algarve in Portugal so uh, hopefully that goes as safely as possible and I hope it's exciting again for uh, customers and staff to work there and number six is Dream Cruises relaunches Taiwan trips next year um, in April time so good luck to Dream Cruises for that hopefully fingers crossed it'll go as well and as safely as possible like everywhere else in the world so well done and if it's safe to do so i hope customers support dream cruises and finally princess cruises have announced uk trips from spring next year so wow wow that's exciting news um again i wish princess cruises the best of luck in regards to um getting customers uh, to go on cruises next year and uh, hopefully they'll do it as safely as, as possible so thank you for watching please like and subscribe share if you haven't already done so and i'll see you in my next travel video which is going to be tomorrow um, because i'm working during the day so it'll be at 8 p.m tomorrow and it's going to be available on my lifestyle channel as well as um, my travel channel so thank you for watching and bye for now i miss all of you and i miss talking about travel i haven't been able to do it as much last week so i'm trying to again double up this week um, because i was working six days at work last week um so i'm just working five days a week this week but again fingers crossed um I will be able to again do more videos um, in regards to my travel and lifestyle channels so anyway good luck and keep safe in the future I love you all you all mean the world to me and bye for now thank you bye